Here's the table below shows the hotness of chili peppers sold by the supermarket in December. All right, so um, there's some sort of scale here, Scoville heat units for hotness of chili peppers. I haven't seen this, I've never heard of this before, right? But I'm assuming um, these ones are probably quite hot anyway, looking at those values, but I'd imagine then these are even much more hotter down here, okay? And then you've got the sales of them. So 1,500 chili peppers um, were sold that would within this heat range. Okay, and then the very hottest ones, um, 500 of them were sold, and so on. So it says here, calculate an estimate of the mean and the median. Okay, median hotness. So we'll come to the median in a minute, right? That's something different. But um, estimate again, right? It will be an estimate because we don't have the exact values. You know, if I had, had we written the exact values for each of these chili peppers, 1,500 of them. Okay, it could be anywhere between these. It would be an absolute mess. You'd have pages and pages of numbers and you wouldn't know where to start. So group frequency table is much tidier. So we're gonna work out an estimate here. So we go for the midpoint again, if you remember the midpoint, okay? And then um, we can use that to work out the mean. But the first thing I will do though, before I, I work out the midpoints, I'm gonna tot up the total year, because remember that's so important, the total frequency, and this is our frequency, of course, column. So 1500 plus 3000, plus 5500, plus 7000, plus 2500, plus 500, and that comes to 20,000, all right, 20,000. So I've added them up on my calculator and um, I've got a total there of 20,000, all right? Now, um, next thing then is we write down these midpoints. So the midpoint there between 1,000 and 3,000, of course, would be 2,000. So I'll just squeeze it in here, okay? And the midpoint there will be 3,250. Midpoint there will be 3,750. So remember, to get the midpoint, you can, you know, you, you could add them up, couldn't you? Add them up and then divide by two. Midpoint here is 4,250. We've got 4,750, and then we've got um, that'll be 6,000, wouldn't it? 6,000 the midpoint there. So just to double check these, I've done these right. That does look right to me there. Yeah, that looks that looks fine. So then what we do, we we'll multiply all of these. Remember to get the mean, and we're going to get like a huge value here. Okay, um, but that's okay. I'm just trying to squeeze this in. So we've got 1,500 times that. In fact, what I'll do is, rather than writing all that here, because I'm going to run out of room, I'll just I'll work out this calculation, and I'll write that answer down. So we've got 1,500 where by the, the temperature, or whatever this unit is, it's not temperature, isn't it? It's some sort of unit. We're estimating to be 2,000. So 1,500 times 2,000, and that will be 3 million. Okay, so six zeros. Okay, and then we've got 3,000 times 3,250, okay, 3,000 of them. So that's gonna be 9750000. Gotta be careful here with all these zeros. Get it right. And then 5,500 times 3,750. So that's gonna be a big number. Okay. Um, and then we've got 7,000 times 4,250. It's going to be 297500000. I'm still going to round our room. Um, and then we've got, uh, what are we on to now? We've, I've done, I've forgotten what I'm on to now. I've done those four, haven't I? Yeah. So now I've got two to go. So then I've got 2,500 times 4,750. So that's, I'll just have to add them here. 1187500. And then um, I've got. 500 times 6,000, okay? So that would be 3 million, okay? So we basically, we're essentially then gonna divide all of that, okay, by how many are there? Okay, so there were 20,000 um, chili peppers. So next step then is to add all these numbers at the top, right? So, you know, we're going to be busy here typing this in. So 3 million plus 975 and then um, four zeros plus um, 20625 and then three zeros plus 
five and then three zeros plus then three and then what's that six zeros yeah i think it is so if i add all that up it comes to seven eight and then i've got six zeros after it so 78 million okay and we'll divide that then by twenty thousand. so we'll, we'll get that then with this we'll divide by twenty thousand. so in fact i could cancel these zeros couldn't i should you you know use your calculator though um there'll be less typing for my calculator then so that's seven thousand eight hundred then divide by two and that comes out to be three thousand nine hundred okay now you know because we've dealt with such big numbers here right you're going to get method marks and, you know you've gone wrong you'll, you'll still get method marks but it's important you take your time on it but you know if you've gone wrong method marks but let's just check our answer does it make sense 3900 well yeah it's in there isn't it it's in where we'd expect it to be 3900 so that's great okay so we can write that there and then it says estimate for the mean now quite simply for the mean you've got to use this value here Okay, you've got uh, for the median, sorry, estimate for the median. You've got to use this value here, the 20,000, right? That is so important, that 20,000, right? If you think about it, if there's 20,000 chili peppers, which one would be in the middle? Okay, which one would be in the middle? Well, basically, roughly the 10,000th one would be in the middle, wouldn't it? The 10,000th one would be in the middle because there's 20,000 of them half of them will be 10,000. So what we need to see is what group 10,000 would be in, okay? So um, again, we use our calculator. Now we've got 1,500 there to start with, but we haven't got to 10,000 yet. Plus then the 3,000, to see what that comes to, 4,500. And we haven't got to, we haven't got to 10,000 yet. Plus then 5,500. Oh, we've actually got to 10,000, okay? So actually, 10,000 is in that top half there, isn't it? And then there's going to be 10,000 underneath there, yeah? So if we've got 10,000 chili peppers going that way and 10,000 chili peppers going that way, in the middle is going to be essentially here, yeah? That's where the, the median's going to be. So the median's going to be here, where that group ends and where this group starts. So if you think about it, going to be 4,000, isn't it? 4,000, because essentially you've got 10,000 chili peppers that are less than 4,000, and you've got 10,000 that are greater than 4,000. So the median is going to be 4,000.